Hi, I'm Emma George. When I go away camping for a weekend, I like to keep my food nice and simple. That means I've got more time to spend with the kids. I love having my angle because it keeps everything cold. And let me show you how I pack it. I like to use the lock and lock containers because it keeps everything together and means I can fit more in my fridge and it stops things like grapes and cherry tomatoes getting bruised. I also use the small little basket because it keeps my cheeses, my butter and most importantly chocolate all together. I also keep the milk and if you run out of milk I always take a spare UHT milk in a container. I've also got my condiments and cream but again I've got my bacon in a container and ham and I also like to keep my salad in one large container. I've washed it all before I left. That makes it easy for me just to chop up and dish it to the kids. So my first night is just gonna be hamburgers. It's so simple to cook on the fire and I've got the hamburger buns in the dry food container and with a bit of salad, it makes an easy meal. And generally through the week, I make a little bit of extra of something like a spaghetti bolognese or a curry. This one I've just vacuum packed, I put it in the freezer, so there's an easy second meal. So let's have a look at what dry food I pack and I'll put this back in the angle. When I'm packing my dry food, I like to keep it in a tub with a lid because it stops animals like possums getting into your food or rain if it's wet. I keep my eggs in here, cereal, snacks for the kids. I've got my hamburger buns and some bread. I've also got my pasta and fruit, as well as a pancake shape for the next day, spreads for sandwiches, muesli bars, salt and pepper, olive oil. So you really don't need a lot of food for a weekend away. So if you plan your meals, make it simple, means you've got lots of time to spend with the family, and that's what camping's all about.